stand for the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, for liberty and justice for all. Greetings, Oxbow Creek students, staff, and families. Welcome to a new week. We had a wonderful family fun night last week. I'd like to thank you all for coming out. And I'd like to thank those of you who participated in our silent auction, both with purchases and with donations. We are so appreciative of your support. This week, we have our fifth graders who are continuing their MCA testing in science. Congratulations to our third, fourth, and fifth graders for persevering and showing hard work and determination as they completed the reading and math assessments. Great work. Well, this is Dylan, and Dylan is in Mrs. White's class. Is that true? Mm -hmm. yes. yes, and Dylan is here for an award demonstrating perseverance. Dylan, the information from your teacher says some fabulous things about you and your work. It says throughout the school year that Dylan has shown amazing perseverance. He's had great determination, not only when you're working independently, but also you are determined to make sure that you understand what's going on in class. Can you tell me something about that? I try to make sure like I understand it so I don't like not doing anything wrong and I don't get myself in an awkward situation. Oh, that's good. Nobody likes an awkward situation, right, bud? But how is it helping your learning? I think it's helping my learning quite a, quite a bit so I can start understanding what's happening. And that's the whole purpose, right? Mm -hmm. Absolutely. Thank you for working so hard, Dylan, and showing us perseverance. Keep up the good work, and I hope you continue to see how your perseverance really impacts your academic skills and growth. Thank you. Okay, and this is Sean. And Sean, who's your teacher? Miss Hagberg. Miss Hagberg, and you are here because you have also demonstrated perseverance. You demonstrate determination, grit, endurance, and patience while learning. Those are some incredible traits, Sean. If things get challenging, you do something pretty cool. Your teacher says, says that you smile and laugh to work things out. Is this true? Yeah. Tell me about that. Usually if I don't know something, I usually just try to make it more fun, and then I'll try to, I guess, f think about it some more. Making it more fun, does that help lighten maybe some of the pressures and help you think even more? Yeah, sometimes. That sounds like a pretty great strategy. You also persevere in social situations. How does that attitude about lightening the mood, laughing and smiling, help you persevere in social situations? I guess, like, there's an example. If I'm, like, with a partner, like, I guess I would, like, if they don't know something, I'll just laugh and help them sometimes. Laughing and helping. Staying focused on a solution. That is a great way to show perseverance. Sean, we are so grateful for all that you're doing to show perseverance. Keep up the good work, buddy. Okay. In class, Liana, what do you think Wild About Learning is? Good. It is good. It's really exceptional. I'm going to give you an example, Liana, about what your teacher says you do to show that you're wild about learning. This says that in class, when... You are working. You're always giving your very best effort. Is that true? Yeah. Do you work hard all the time? Yeah. Hard work is a great way to show that you're wild about learning. This also says that when your teacher asks a question and wants the whole group to answer, she can always hear your voice. What do you think about that? Good. That is good. You have improved and shown growth in every single academic area this year. Whoa. What do you think about that? Good. It is good. The other thing is that you are a great friend to your classmates. Thank you so much, Liana. Keep up the good work. Okay. Alex, we talked a little bit about what it means to be wild about learning, and your teachers have shared what you do that shows that you're wild about learning. You are an amazing student, and you're committed 
this is like makes my heart just leap with joy. You are committed to challenging yourself. What? Tell me about that. How do you commit always to challenging? So when I don't know something, I'm trying to like figure out what the answer is. Yeah. And how do you stay so excited about always wanting to learn and grow and challenge yourself? Is it fun? Yeah. How is it fun? That I'm learning new things even though I don't get a question right. Oh my goodness. I think you just summed everything up about what it really truly means to be wild about learning. It's not about things always being easy. It's about staying committed to challenging yourself so that you can learn and grow. And what I'm hearing from you, Alex, and I hope others hear from you as well, is that challenging yourself, persevering, learning and growing feels pretty what? Good. It feels pretty good. Keep up the good work. Thank you.